All right, you guys, I'm back. So I have washed uh, my greens a few times. So now I'm gonna get ready to put them in the pot. And um, your water, you'll kind of smell the greens as you're washing them and your water will turn green, basically. As you're, you know, swishing them around, you'll just, you know, it'll hit you. So, so I got me a bowl that I'm gonna use to transport them to the pot. That's all regular bowl. Just to transport them, you know. And like I said, they're going to, um, they're gonna boil down. So this is what I got in the first to go in. So, hope the steam don't. So yeah, this is them going in. I might have to get a bigger pot, y'all. Look at it. Don't that look good? Don't that look good, y'all? Don't that look good? Look good. That look good. Wish y'all had smell of vision. Yeah, I might have to get a bigger pot. What y'all think? Y'all think I might get a big pot? Bigger pot? We'll see. We'll let these boil down. I put a few more in here. Man, it smells mighty, mighty, mighty good, y'all. Your girl gonna be eating good. All right. So we're gonna go ahead and kind of let those boil down a little bit. And um, I'm gonna go ahead and take the rest of my water because I need to go ahead and clean my, um, because I need to clean my pork chop. I mean, I'm a pork chop, I'm sorry, my neck bone. See, this water is green. So they let you know you did a good wash. And you wanna get all your little, your little bits and pieces and stuff, you know, all your little stems and all that. So did you guys do any, what did you guys have planned on this Saturday? Did you do anything or did you just kind of relax, chilled out? Um, like I said, I went and got my eyebrows done and got my nails done. I don't know if y'all can really tell my eyebrows. Um, I don't really have thick eyebrows, so did what she could, you know, um, just some type of little, little definition or something, you know, not too, nothing too, um, you know, nothing too major, but I think they're kind of cute, though. Y'all yeah, don't know what the camera I'm looking at, so if I'm looking off in space, just charge to the game. <laughs> I'm gonna give me a vlog, I wanna get me a vlogging camera, so, um, I don't know what kind, I don't wanna spend a whole, whole lot of money right now on one since I'm just starting out. But I do want one where I guess the little, the screen is up at the top where you can kind of flip it around. Um, that way you can kind of have the camera on you and then turn it around and still be able to record and different stuff like that. Because right now I'm recording on my iPhone. So it's kind of hard to flip it while you're doing the video. Um, because if I put it on me, then it's gonna stay on me and won't let me change the camera to flip it to the other side. So yeah. So, okay, so my water's gone out. Just wanna make sure you clean your sink out. And you put all the excess greens and stems in the trash. Like I said, they will have your house smelling. If um, you don't get them out. So now, we're gonna go ahead and clean these uh, neck bones. I don't know, I might have to give me another bump or two, y'all. I don't know, but we're gonna let them kind of go down first. So, so I'm gonna put my neck bones in this strainer right here. And these 
said these are uh these are beef neck bones. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I ever I don't know what I was thinking about. But yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and wash the neck bones. You always want to wash your meat and stuff. You just want to wash your meat because that meat be nasty. So you want to make sure you wash it really, 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 really good. Really good. You got to wash it. You got to. You got to, honey. You gotta wash that meat. And make sure like when you, um, if you like wash your meat and stuff or season your meat and stuff in your sink, make sure when you finish, you bleach your sink really, really good. You kill all the germs and stuff like that. And also you wanna make sure you throw that meat flat out too. Cause that dry blood and stuff, that's, it don't, don't smell good at all. So normally, like when I set it out in my um, my trash, you know, outside, I normally would, like rinse the um, this little styrofoam thing out and put bleach in it before I set it outside. You know, put it in my trash outside so it won't it won't attract like um, you know pests and stuff. So yeah, so I'm rinsing out this. So let that sit. Wash my hands again. Antibacterial soap. I make sure I don't get any on the meat. And if I do, oh well. When, when, when that heat hit it, it's gonna kill it anyway. All right. So that's done. Meat is clean, right? y'all see all right so y'all see the meat all right so we done with the meat the neck bones are clear for takeoff right okay so let me get my other pot from the neck bones baby You know what? This part of the pot I should put them greens in. But we gonna see y'all. We gonna see. I'll tell that dog my stack this dishwasher on it cause ooh Jesus. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and uh -oh. go ahead and get our water going for a neck bone. Smelling good. I mean, they smelling good. <laughs> good. So my greens are on. I cleaned my neck bones. So now I'm gonna season, put my uh, more water on, and my season for um, my neck bones. So I'm gonna cut up me an onion and a bell pepper. Put my no salt. So I'm gonna move you guys over here. And watch me do my thing. Well, you know, hey, I'm improvising over here, so y'all just bear with me. So, I got my accent. That's not the one. Okay, so I got my accent here. So I put my accent in there. I put a lot of accent in it.
just a little salt, just a little bit, just a little, because you don't want it too salty. Nobody likes no salty food. And then, voila, magic, bam. My no salt, boo. That's that, that's that. That's that magic. That's that mmm, mmm, good. You should try it, y'all. If you, you're in Houston or if you have a 99 cent store in your local town or city or whatnot, I'm telling you. Man, them colors, they cutting up. They are cutting up, y'all. Oh, man, they smell good. Look. I'm excited already, honey. Already. You see that seam? You see it? Mm, 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 mm. That's going to be some show sure enough good eating tomorrow, Lord's will. Okay, so this is my water for my neck bones. I got my no salt, my accent, my regular salt. Like I said, I'm going to cut me an onion and a bell pepper. Wait a minute, do I have a bell pepper? Scratch the bell pepper, y'all. Just got onions, so that's, well, we just gonna work with what we got. That's, that's what we do. That's what we do. So just so guess what? It's just gonna be an onion. It's all good, though. Oh, you know what? I got that onion blend in a bag. It, well, it's, it's, it's kind of like a stir fry, fry. It has like the bell, yellow bell peppers, red and green and onions. Um. My mama used it too. And then, then it's another kind that they use um, that had everything already chopped up and you just pour it in your pot. That's what my mama used. But I don't, I don't, I don't know if I have any of that. But that's one thing about it, baby. I'm gonna always have some onion. Always. <laughs> I, I cook a lot with onion. Like onion and garlic powder, a lot. So I'm gonna always have that. Okay, so the onion is in there. I'm gonna go ahead and let that marinate, let that do what it do. So we're gonna let that season and I'll be back to put my neck bones on. See you in a little bit. <laughs> 